Well, hello there, ladies. How is your manager? Is it fresh? Yeah? This video is probably for you. Hold your head up to the sky. I'm gonna roll with you till the day I die. Have you mm, ever used one of these before? I'm sure you do. This is a UV lamp. Today we're going to talk about it. But first, let me move this piece of art. Have you ever wondered if the UV nail lamps used for the perfect gel manicure could be harming your skin? While they give us long-lasting nails, they could also be increasing our risk of skin damage or even skin cancer. In today's video, we will be talking about the latest scientific research to uncover the truth about the UV nail lamps and their effects on our skin. UV nails lamps are essentially tools for curing um, the nail polish, emitting ultraviolet A or UVA radiation to harden the polish. UVA rays penetrate deep into your skin and are known to contribute to premature aging or DNA damage. So what does research reveal about their safety? I want to highlight the science behind this discussion too. So recent studies have proved new insights into the potential risk associated with the UV nail lamps. A 2023 study published in Nature Communications exposed human and mouse cells to UV radiation from polish dryers. The findings indicate significant DNA damage and mutation, and signs of cell death in the irradiated cells. The researchers noticed that chronic use of these devices might increase the risk of developing skin cancer. The Skin Cancer Foundation has highlighted that while UV nail lamps emit UVA rays linked to skin aging and cancer, the overall risk is considered moderate and significantly lower than that posed by tanning beds. A systematic review analyzing multiple studies concluded that prolongated and repeated exposure to UV nail lamps may pose a low risk of skin cancer. However, the evidence remains limited and individuals should be informed about these uncertainties to make educated decisions. It's essential to recognize that while these findings are concerning, the direct correlation between UV nail lamps usage and skin cancer in humans requires further investigation. So what are the safety measures and recommendations? Given the potential risk, it's prudent to take precautions while using UV nail lamps. Here are some expert recommendations. Apply broad-spectrum sunscreen. Before your manicure, apply a broad-spectrum sunscreen with at least SPF 30 to your hands. This can help mitigate some of the UV exposure. Number two, use protective gloves. Consider wearing fingerless UV gloves during the curing process. These gloves expose only the nails, shielding the surrounding skin from the UV radiation. Number three, limit frequency. Reduce the number of gel manicures you receive to minimize cumulative UV exposure. Opt for regular polish or other alternatives when possible. Number four, explore alternative drying methods. Some salons use LED lamps, which cure polish faster and emit lower levels of UV radiation. However, it's important to know that both UV and LED lamps emit UVA rays, so precautions are still necessary. And by implementing these measures, you can enjoy your manicure while prioritizing your health, which is, of course, more important than nails. While UV nail lamps enhance the durability and appearance of your manicure, it is crucial to be aware of the potential skin risk associated with their use. By staying informed and adopting protective strategies, you can continue to enjoy beautiful nails with without compromising your skin health. If you found this video insightful, please give it a thumbs up, click here for more interesting videos, subscribe for more health-related content, and share your thoughts in the comments down below. Will you be adjusting your manicure routine based on this information or not? Thank you for watching and remember to prioritize your health and safety. Tschüss guys! Tschüss means bye in German. Tschüss!